Okay, take a chance. There you go. All right. <laughs> My name is Chance Williams, and what happened this trip was unexpected. Like this trip, I wanted to learn. Like I just came and just had this like I want to learn. I want to learn. So I get there and uh, we go to church, and I'm sitting in my seat trying to listen, but my ADD kicks in, and I'm like sitting around, like can't sit still, and but I'm still listening, and like I just look around, like all my friends are just worshiping and stuff, and it just like just got to my heart. Well, every day it just grew closer and closer and closer, and like during the days I learned it doesn't matter who you are, it doesn't matter what mistakes you made. It doesn't matter what sin you made, because all the sins are the same in his eyes. And like, even if you made a mistake, you feel like, oh, let him down. No, you didn't let him down. He's still there no matter what path you take. He's just there. And I just, the uh, second last night, I had this like, just this like feeling, like amazing feeling. Like he was in, like he was there. And so they said, stand up. Uh, if you... Christ in your life, and I stood up, and the amazing feeling was, I have it in me, I stood up, and all my closest friends, all my best friends that have been there for me, or been there for me, for everything, uh, put their hand on my shoulders, and just, like, loved me, and just, like, it was very emotional, and so, the next day, because I, I was getting a taste, I was like, alright, and I, I was thinking, I want to my life, I want my life, well, then, last night, we were worshiping, and like, I'm a really shy person, like, I'm just really shy, and I would run up to the stage and dance and just, like, be right in front, and I just started, like, worshiping, like, I've never worshiped before, and so, after that, I just go and I find Jesse, and I'm just like, I want him alive, I want him alive, so we go to a corner, and I just pray, just give it all I have to him, and that was the most amazing thing I've ever felt in my life. Just amazing. I, I couldn't even speak. And so, you know, I was so nervous. He, he wanted me to talk to everyone. I was like, I'm just nervous. Like, okay, okay, I'll talk. So I talk, and it just, I don't know, the Holy Spirit just came through because everyone was shocked the way I talk to people. Because you show a person that stutters or <laughs> say things right. Or, like, just, so my whole point is, like, just don't be down on yourself and don't try to do, do things when you're alone, because it doesn't work. It, trust me, it does not work. I mean, I've gone, uh, I've gone down that road, and I mean, just help. Like, if you find someone else to talk, let it out. Like, they're not going to judge you. Just let it out. And I just all my friends there just, like, love. Like, my, one of my best friends, Zach, like, his sisters got, his sister got baptized. And it just, like, he was so happy. And, like, I, like, love him. So, like, I was happy for him. And it was just an amazing trip. And so what I learned from this is when I came back here, I knew there was going to be trouble. So I'm going to be so tempted no matter what. And I just know I need to surround myself around things that are not going to be tempted. Which sometimes I'm going to be tempted, but I need to go through the right stuff. And no matter if I do tempt, just know that ask for forgiveness and he will give you forgiveness and move on. Don't stay on that sin. Just move on. All right. That's all. Yeah.